Mario. Oh, straight from the Mario. It's going to be a great set. Mario v Dark Pit, looking like. Yeah. yeah, this matchup is like super even. I've ever seen Mario v Pit. Typically, there's just a lot of back and forth. Some edge guards here. Coming off a little bit of dash dancing, Donnie looks like he's not afraid to control the ground space here. I'm gonna weave in and out of Dark Pit's reach, really using his mobility to his advantage. Wolfish, I don't to find an opening, but any good Nair, yeah, here we go. Gonna be great damage here. Ooh, misses the dash grab. Great awareness there on Donnie not to extend too far and get reversal on. That was nice. Wolfish looks like he's pretty hard to find an opening here again. Donnie's spacing has been great this, this match so far. Wow, nice reversal there to catch the jump out of shield by Goldfish. That was beautiful. Oh, looking for the grab off the ledge, get up. Nice reactions there. Not going to get the throw, though. We see Mario struggle a little bit in this matchup. Uh, you're gonna have a lot of situations where you're gonna have to land on and around Dark Pit. Uh, it's a drop jab lock kill. Be okay though. He can mount sort of big deal for Goldfish. Yeah, no jump here. Yep. Yeah, missing a jab lock was a huge deal here. You can press this advantage. Honey looking clean on the sticks though. His inputs have been pretty nice today. Goldfish pushing the advantage here, 34. But extra credit before he loses his stock. Oh man, tough there. Wow, great instant reverse. Reverse back here, that was really fast on Tony, man. I think you wouldn't have seen too much of before. Tell he's been really warming up. Goldfish on the ledge, dangerous situation to be fighting, and he's very good off the ledge get ups here. Ledge trapping is significantly improved, and Dark Pit is so, so good at killing him. That's not gonna be a combo there. Once again, I'm not gonna be, gonna be able to hit the combo. Now, smash on the reaction, ledge get up. Oh, he gets reversal on. If he can press it. Oh, Flood right in the face. Well on safe there, we're not gonna get hurt too bad for it. I'd like to see more threatening by Goldfish when he's landing with some down maybe. It seems like he can probably poke at Mario a little bit, almost like Meta Knight does. Wow, beautiful down smash from the ledge, really doing a lot of damage and carrying a lot of stocks for him typically. Just click there for a forward air, maybe something else. Nice combo there from the ledge, gonna do a little bit extra percent here, get some extra credit. Donnie's really fighting for his life, trying to land on or around Goldfish, and this is the name of the game so far. Spacing has been a huge deal. Is that it, man? Yeah, he lost his jump. Beautiful adaptation by Goldfish. Really turning things around, cleaning things up. In the beginning, I think he was a little unsure of how to play around everything, but figured it out. It was much Goldfish momentum the whole time, so. Great back, great Mario stage, I do know that. Um, I think that's pretty good here also. Let's see some, a little bit harder extensions by Donnie. I think that'll be, that'll kind of help him get ahead. Um, last di last game, he did drop some combos. That could have definitely put him ahead pretty hard. Here he goes. Nice damage there. Not gonna take a kill, but, oh my God, reading the shield too. That was beautiful. Oh my god, Donnie are reading these air dodges like nothing else right now. Big back airs. 
heats on for Goldfish right now. He's really going to find an answer. Once again, game starting off almost identical to the, the first game of the set, the last game. And a big lead for Donnie here. But once again, the Nair's out of shield is catching Donnie's jumps. Doesn't seem to be much of a mix up on when he does jump. Um, and from the ledge, it seems Donnie's timing is very similar. So Goldfish is able to take full advantage of that. Oh my god, almost getting the kill confirm off the down air. Those windows can be pretty tight to confirm off of though. No dash grab. Goldfish really has a lot of patience here for this. Yeah, gonna catch the jump, gonna get the kill. Aim of the game right here. Goldfish has been really reading these jumps. And obviously Mario is a character that likes to go air to air, but against Pig, you have to super hard respect its aerials and his anti-air up smash or, you know, even some of his other moves. Nice. Are you going to even things out here? A grab or a uh, like a small hill opening by either player could be a huge advantage. Not going to get his jump stolen there. Goldfish playing the ledge like a pro right now. Ooh, whipping jab. Donnie going to trade right back at him. Not going to catch the tech up tilt though. Almost had a tech chase with that. It was a pretty interesting situation. We'll see more of that. Is that it? Almost dying to the upbeat. No down here, I'm surprised. Maybe I wouldn't have killed. Donnie bringing us all the way back. Mario combos are seriously destructive sometimes. No matter if you kill or not, you're doing so much damage and you're in a horrible position. Really really changed it up this game. I think last game there were a lot of misclicks. I do know Donnie plays other characters. Great stock though. Goldfish looking like he's also getting anti-air for stocks. And it's a pain off for both players here. Hopefully they can maybe mix in some neutral air dodges or some fade back, some timing changes. Great cross on the DI there. Up there not going to kill though. Oh my god, the patience on Donnie to just wait when he knows he doesn't have a true combo. He's gotten so much damage and got a lot of air dodges, but Goldfish not going to give it that time. Oh, Fortro almost going to kill. I'm surprised you can see the arrow shoot there. Just the trade with the cape might have been a little too much for a risk. Oh my god, nice parry, not going to get the kill. Oh my god, they're both, both dancing around each other right now. Anything could happen. Oh, no grab at a shield, could have been a back throw, or maybe even an upbeat at a shield. Yeah, I'm going to do just fine, though. The goldfish been winning here. Yep, going to get the forward throw. Yeah, this sort of thing's going to be a little scary for Mario. Not able to really get any combos here that can take stocks, and I just have to get some nice reads. couple good reads here, two interaction wins. You should be able to win this. Um, goldfish really mounting a comeback, though. This is dangerous territory for him. It is master of the edge guard, so as long as you can get Mario off stage, you should be able to trade the up B if he has no jump. We'll see what can happen though. Oh my god, almost looking for the frame trap on the air dodge there. The American air dodge. Almost costing Donnie there. Oh my god. He's getting that very last hit of down arrow Mario. Mario Tornado gonna. Not kill yet though. Oh. What's that? Oh. <laughs> Alright, let's see if Donnie can get out of the corner. This is scary now. Wow, the parry up smash. Gonna make it a 1 1 situation. Yeah, this is a tight set. We got a couple really nice sets to start off the day. Hope everyone in the chat is having a good time. I'd like to see where we go for a stage counter pick. I'm assuming Donnie would ban FD Kalos. <laughs> Certainly no Lilat here. We do not run Lilat. Smashville, okay. It's a great pit stage. I'm not surprised we're seeing this.
Mario can get great combos here, but against characters with a lot of rage like Pit, it can definitely be a little bit of an issue. Um, the space control with that platform can be a little hard for Mario to move around. But at the same time, his mobility and his combo tracking on this platform and fireballs and such can really help him too. Um, you know, both very well versed characters. So, see what they can utilize here. Great edge guards here. Yeah, just gonna take that jump. Goldfish only 7% on the board, 16 now. Johnny's really gotta find some opening. Negative on hit for up air until about now, so. Goldfish combos don't do a ton of damage, but the positioning is what matters here. Johnny with a great optimal combo there with the Nair, not gonna force an up B. God, once again, off the ledge, it just seems that Wolfish just has such a read on Donnie and what he wants to do next. Ooh, weak Nair. Oh my god, almost forcing an SD. Honestly, it's pretty interesting, even if it's risky for Pit to do that. Uh, something to look into. Delay the recovery and force on the slant. Wow! Great call on the up B. It was loving that right there. The interactions at the ledge and off stage near the ledge. Goldfish has been king of this set. B6, man. This is awful territory. He's got to make a move. These air dodges are going to cost him. Almost losing the trade again in the up B. <laughs> Just going to eat an arrow for his troubles there. And you know, that's a great stage pick by Goldfish. He knows that having that center control with the platform is just a huge help to him in this matchup. And calling out the jumps and playing the ledge game is so hard that forcing that to happen more often is a big deal. Down throw forward air, no back air, up air there. I do know with uh, some DI checks, some DI reads every so often, if you put DI in, you do those down throw a pit, though. Okay, not often. Oh my god, what a snipe. Beautiful job there by Goldfish. The adaptation was beautiful, that set. Absolutely just cleaning things up. We saw Donnie uh, flip the switch on him that second game, though. Yeah, green guy in Costa.